6,005, Mary Tyler Moore, uh, Abel, more. take one. <laughs> what? More, more. What? More plays a meddler who is full of mirth. More is part Lucy and part Mary Worth. Tip, when am I going to grow tip? <laughs> Nothing you've done can be so loathsome, so weird, so perverted that I won't understand. And even if I don't understand, you'll be able to uh, explain it to me. Let's go back. What? Let's go back. <laughs> oh, that was, a, that was a healthy roll. Yeah. It was a natural bobble. People do that, you know. <laughs> you know, it's been a good week for news. Some good human interest, a couple of juicy scandals, and just enough disasters. Like this like one. Hi, <laughs> guys. Hi. Oh, boy. <laughs> keep going, keep going. Uh, am I in trouble? <laughs> What's the matter, Ted? Murray, Mayor, I'm on a level with you. Business at the hat store couldn't be worse. Can't understand it. <laughs> Hi, guys. Boy, am I in trouble. What's the matter, Ted? I wish I knew what to say. <laughs> It's the 15th birthday anniversary of Clomber Spring. Oh, no, I'm not falling for that. Because if that's a joke, that would be the perfect thing to say to, to me to convince me that it wasn't. <laughs> oh, lo oh, shit. I have a responsibility to maintain the high standards in this newsroom. <laughs> Wait till you see what I got for you. You've never seen anything like this in your life. Roast duckling for two. intelligence would want to watch a show or be on a show like that. <laughs> Got it. Uh, remember when the Japanese uh, remember when the Japanese attacked uh, remember when the Japanese Japanese attacked uh, Pearl Harbor? Remember when the Japanese attacked Pearl Harbor? Uh, remember when the Japanese uh, attacked Pearl uh, Harbor? Uh -huh. Well, that was close. <laughs> 
think it went? <laughs> <laughs> that, that goes for me, too. I was mean, rude, and rotten all night. Oh, Ed, don't apologize. You were just being stupid. <laughs> Look, Ed. <laughs> I really don't want to talk about it. Mary, dear, you've helped everybody with his problems. You get a lot of credit for it, too. Oh, bless your heart. Even affection. <laughs> I just didn't want to be alone in this thing. I thought if everybody else could come out here and Laos... <laughs> oh, to get to know each other, to dig beneath the surface. Did you take that speech? All right, Jay, did you like it that much? <laughs> Georgette Franklin. This is Father. <laughs> Lou! Look who he is here, Mr. Grant Suez. Hello, Lou. Hi, Sue. Yes. Mary Louse, double R. I think if you asked uh, musical comedy buffs, Broadway musical comedy buffs, who the first man was to talk a song. In a musical comedy. With this audience, that's all you'd have to say. If you were to ask people who the first man was to do that, they would guess, I suppose, Rex Harrison in My Fair Lady or perhaps Robert Preston in The Music Man, something of that sort. Wrong, my friends. The truth is, the first man to talk a song in a musical comedy was our own Stan Daniels in the Second Avenue Yiddish Theater production of Showboat. when he talked the beloved ballad, Old Man River. <laughs> Let me set the scene for you. The riverboat, Cotton Blossom, is at the pier. Magnolias are in bloom. The air is heavy with the scent of honeysuckle. Southern bells walk up and down the levee with their parasols. In the cotton fields away, the hum of bees can be heard. Am I padding enough for you lads? <laughs> and as the fog begins to drift in off the river, the burly stevedore Joe steps to the end of the pier, places one massive foot on a coiled line, and talks the beloved Old Man River. Stand in. There's an old man called the Mississippi. That's the old man I long to be. What does he care if the world got troubles? What does he care if the land ain't free? Old man river. That old man river. He don't do nothing. He don't say nothing. He keeps rolling. He keeps rolling a lot. He don't plant potatoes. He don't plant cotton. Them that plants them is soon forgotten. Old Man River, he keeps rolling along. You, me, we sweat, we strain. Body's aching, rack me pain. Put that barge, lift that bale. You get a little drunk, you land in jail. I get weary, I'm sick of trying, I'm tired of living, I'm scared of dying, but, but old man river, he keeps rolling along. <laughs> Georgia, 
those close-up shots go is the one that fans adore, cause the show is owned by Moore.